Hello and welcome to the Division full game, finally. The wait is over. <clears throat> it's taken, oh geez, a long time. I, If my memory serves me correct, this game was announced in 2013. Or I might be wrong, or 2014, but still, it, it got delayed a lot. A lot. But it's it's finally out, it's finally here. So, I'm super excited. You can check out my videos from the the betas down in the description of the playlist. For when, if you want to see, compare the changes between the betas. Because there were some. There were some changes. So, some of those good Dark Zone moments. I have some some footage that I was able to fix the technical difficulties on from the open beta. I might go up. That might go up sometime as like a small montage because there was a lot of server issues going on and then some recording issues. But that aside, and servers are busted. Hello and welcome finally to the full division game. And by. Finally, finally, I mean, the servers have been very, very slow. So, I've, like, not been able to connect for a long time. So maybe finally... Oh! Okay. Jumping right into it. Oh, they're poisoning money? Oh, I see. Wow. Back on the breaking news, leading with unconfirmed reports of a smallpox small outbreak. outbreak is a highly rehearsed scenario. And National Guard units converging no on a trains, hospital in Central Bridges Manhattan. are closed. It's a more than a is a very real more danger. Than more than a goal. No, let me stop you there. This is not a panic situation. An entire American Whoa. city. Whoa. Green poison. Central Park has been converted to a mass burial ground. Power outages, gas line leaks, fires. The government is expecting another night of widespread looting. The people of New York are begging. What would it cost? <laughs> First responders are either dead. No resources available. They treat it like animals. It's not a job. We're not trained for. Wow. <clears throat> we were activated. We knew the situation was bad. Worse than anyone knew. We are an elite, highly skilled group of embedded agents. They only call us when everything else has failed. We have no rules. We have no limits. Our job is to protect what remains. We are your co-workers. We are your neighbors. We might even be your friends. But when we get the call, we leave everything behind. We are the division. Wow, I wonder if their wrists ever get sore from wearing that watch all the time. Wow. Okay, that's 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 really cool. For a character creator, just saying. That's awesome. Okay, here we go. In authorizing agent. <clears throat> Isaac, your purchases are now available. Tech cover at the marker to begin weapon verification. Weapon test initialized. Up and fire at the highlighted targets. 
You have unlocked rewards for taking Primary weapon weapon. test successful. Weapon test initialized. Up and fire at the highlighted targets. Side off test successful. You have unlocked. Welcome aboard, Agent. This is Louis Chang, Northeast Section Commander <coughs> of the Division. You have been activated because Brooklyn has become dangerously unstable. Isaac has updated us with your progress. Proceed to the nearest safe house for your full equipment loadout. Okay. Sweet. Okay, so lots of... I did do all the unlocks in the Ubisoft club, because I wanted all of them. So, that is cool. So. Agent, I've confirmed that your fellow agent Faye Lau has arrived here. Check in with her when you get inside. It's tough. Okay. Enter the safe house. Readings indicate this area is safe. Oh, there's a bunch of level one people. Wow. Oh, wow, jeez, there's a lot. Gear vendor. Brooklyn matchmaking. Find agents. We're losing this whole neighborhood. Riders are moving through, in force, and headed this way. Put your people there. I see someone else got the call. I'm Agent Fei Lau, Division. Activated the same time as you, part of the second wave of us going in. I don't know what happened to the first wave, but unfortunately, there's still lots left for us to do. We don't have much intel, and we don't have the luxury of failure. Not with Manhattan under lockdown and Brooklyn on the brink. People like me. And you. We're what's left to hold the line. With any luck, we'll have more to go on once we rendezvous with the commander. More about the situation, about who's turning the streets into a war zone. Anything that's going to help us do what we're supposed to do. And if you'll excuse me, Lieutenant. Officer Hazen and his team are handling situation reports. If you're looking for a hot spot, that's who you want to talk to. Okay. Complete your activation at the terminal to enable Directive 51 operational status and equipment. Yeah, it's uh, it's not fun recording when you got allergies, but oh well. Identity confirmed. SHD equipment activated. Request situation. Hey, got you here, agent. I've never seen Brooklyn like this. We're barely hanging on. I'll be your point of contact for any emergency ops. We've had plenty of action and it's not letting up. Jesus. I'm not gonna have any hair left when this thing is done. Wow, you're you're thinking about your hair man in this kind of situation? <laughs> That's really what you're thinking about? Okay, I see I see your priorities. I see his priorities. Let's go with that. I like the sticky bomb from the beta. <clears throat> Restore Brooklyn or Chief Food Supplies. I don't think that's what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Brooklyn matchmaking. Nobody's got a better selection. I'll be oh, here yeah, really? Play. I think everybody has a better selection than that, buddy. <laughs> Unlocked at level four. Got a feature that's calling your name, doesn't it? find out how it works. I guess I gotta do these side now outs. Leaving the safe area. Isaac can intercept transmissions from locations on the map, so you can get a little more intel on what you're getting into. Okay. Agent, Riders took the weekly food supply from the Brooklyn Heights Distribution Center. They try and sell it back to all the starving people. Plain and simple profiteering on the backs of people who are suffering. Get that food back. Keep it up. 
Missing supply crate located. Okay. Do, 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 do. So this is kind of the tutorial zone, I guess. The white. Oh, almost like Witcher 3 is white orchard. Kind of getting players into it. And then I guess at level 4 they let us go to the other parts. So that's fun. It's not like the, the Destiny beta. Where it was like. You. He spent a long time replaying stuff you'd already done in the beta. I mean, I'm gonna end up doing that on this, but I'm glad that it starts off with fresh stuff. Where the food at? Food. Confirmed. Pick up mark. GTF notified. Okay. Great work, agent. We'll get that food back to the people who need it. Sweet. Okay. Next mission at. Agent, those rioters have stolen a crate of morphine. Probably gonna try and sell it or use it. We've got people in real pain who need those drugs. See if you can recover that crate. Morphine, yeah, that's pretty important. Any new emotes? Nope, same ones. So I wonder if they're gonna let you come back to Brooklyn or if this is just like a one-time deal while you're learning the game. They probably have it set up that way, that there's only enough stuff to get to level 4 and then once you're done you move on. Or you could be dead wrong, it might be they send you back here sometime or let you come back. <clears throat> Probably what's, um, like a lot of people talk about, there's a lot of discussion with this game about like how the multiplayer works and like the loot systems and stuff, I've talked about it, because like they're not, like Destiny tried to play the name game of Share World Shooter and stuff, and it seems like Ubisoft really hasn't addressed, like, Put a Confirm. name on this Pick game GTF in, in that sense, which is smarter them, but Sparrow Five here. We're approaching your position now. So a lot of people get caught up talking about that, but Morning. Hostile forces approaching. What really impressed me with the betas and playing the full game now is the, is the city. Like, if this is at least trying to be an MMO type game, a game that is trying to take your time away from other games and really be kind of a, a long, have long legs and last a long time, then it, I think having a very strong world, uh, game world is important and this one seems to have that, so. And as far as the end game concerns, I did see that they announced that the end game, got the weird name, incursions or something, sort of, I guess their name for I guess like a raid or strike type activity, dungeon type thing, is in uh, April, a month from launch or so, and then that will add player trading, so I hope there's a, a good amount of content in the base game, I guess they either don't, they probably haven't finished development on that, but then it also helps because players can get all the high level gear, so people who will play a lot until it comes out, we'll be ready and can, they can throw some difficult challenges, high level stuff out. So, at least that's my hope. Properly. 
So this is going to be probably should have mentioned this sooner. This is going to be a full story walkthrough. So Attention. we've gotten word of a hostage situation at a bank. Looks like you'll have to go through the subway tunnel to access the building. We need you to move in and minimize the damage. This will be a story walkthrough going through all the, the main story missions. This counts because this is a tutorial setting up the game, even though it's technically side missions. They're still blocking main progress, so that sort of thing. So, I'm not sure how many main story missions there are, but I'll be doing a video on, on them. So. Morning. Hostile presence detected. I do, I do like this idea of a tutorial. They gave us the direct tutorial of cover, change weapons. I'm glad they had changed weapons. And then shoot, and now they're kind of giving us the lighter like, stuff as we go. Like, equip your thingy. Use your grenades. I like it. Area secured. Hostiles neutralized. So, well, I guess the beta was a beta. It's kind of funny, because like, with the beta, there was... Very little tutorial. It was just like, here you go. Nice work shutting that down, Agent. Finally. Oh, thank you so much. That was thank you. Terrifying. You're welcome. No, I need to get the hell out of here. Got a shotgun. Oh, no, that's good. Hmm. Hmm. So it's interesting how with the beta they they really set up everybody good with the the green guns. I don't know if it automatic if when I finish the tutorial area it's automatically gonna give all greens. But that would be a kind of sneaky way to um to give players an easier like in on the um <clears throat> on the game for the beta. Work gloves, level 3. Oh, I'm level 2 right now. I don't know, since skills are tied to... Since skills are tied directly to missions and upgrading the base, I, w I wonder if there's anything you get when you level up. Or if leveling up is just the, um... Well, level. Like, oh, you can equip this gun now, or you can play this mission now. You got more damage and all that. <coughs> so. It seems like you can get all the skills in the game and then just customize it how you feel. But I could be wrong. I haven't seen anything that would indicate a limit on what you can do because all of the skill, all of this, the items to upgrade the. the branches of the forward operating base are um what's gonna call it they've got different uh materials supplies that's it it's like tech supplies medical supplies so and I guess security out. supplies so fantastic work agent I think you put the lid back on this place just when it was about to boil over we all thank you. And I wanted to say personally that I've lived in Brooklyn my whole life. So what you've done means a lot to me. Can't you see I'm dancing? I'm so happy. Precinct Siege. Okay. Let's go. Got a uh, hundred and fifty meters to go. So, I will say the waiting on the servers was very annoying with this game. I mean, I understand a lot of people are playing it, and well, they seem to even out now. So, hopefully, they won't have any issues. Which I'm, I'm surprised I was able to get on 
as soon as I did, but I still had to wait a while. So that was kind of frustrating. <laughs>